Did all of that get out of hand? It did, yes. It sort of just had a life of its own and it yeah, became its own organism. Yeah. yeah. You became known worldwide for this. Yes. And it became something that you were identified with. Yes. How did that make you feel? Ah, that's a really good question, but, um, well, as Margaret Thatcher says, who cares who I feel? Who cares what I feel? I, I think that this is an opportunity to stand for who I am. Mm. It doesn't matter what I feel. Did you ever have a conversation with your dad after that? I mean, about it specifically? Yes, of course. And were you ever upset with him for having said that out loud? No, I wasn't. I, I, again, I, a lot of people ask me, whether I've been upset by, you know, and a lot of people on the internet, they've expressed anger or, or, or rage even mm. um, over what my dad has done. Quite honestly, I think it's just his way of rescuing the, the, the situation, which caught him off guard. You said before that, um, that Hong Kong is a much more conservative society, even more so than the United States and China. That's correct. That's yes. crazy to think in a city that's constantly growing, changing, evolving. It's an interesting but sad irony, isn't it? It, um, it is ironic, um, but it's not as ironic as you think because a lot of Hong Kong is built on some aspects of not changing. So I think that's a huge part of Hong Kong as well. I mean, the main reason for that is um, a lot of a lot of what Hong Kong is is, is family ties and mm -hmm. relationships in this tiny, small, overcrowded place, and um, and uh, there's a lot of people that want to keep it that way. You've also actually said now that you will spend as long as it takes to get your father and your partner Sean together, together, sit down, maybe for a nice dinner. How long do you think that'll take? Oh, 10 years, 20 years. I'm aiming at 20. If we can achieve it less than 20, then it's a win. <laughs>